All right. Uh, hey, it has been 75 years, can you believe, since Jackie Robinson. He broke through the color barriers to play his first Major League Baseball game. Today, the Tampa Bay Rays honored his life and legacy. They, along with the community, have taken on a project in South St. Pete. 10 Tampa Bay's Hannah Deneen walks you through the 16th Street Community Garden. Jackie Robinson was a toeblazer. I think Jackie Robinson broke a lot of barriers, particularly as it pertains to the, the color barriers. With the legacy of Jackie Robinson on their hearts, the hands of Tampa Bay Rays staff and volunteers are busied with building 12 raised garden beds. What we will be doing is creating um, seasonal fruits and vegetables, herbs for the uh, members of the community. Accessible to all locals for free. Our goal is to break that barrier, to bridge that affordability gap to allow it to, to be something that everyone can access and not people with a certain budget or a certain income. The unassuming courtyard that houses the new community garden now bursting with potential. It was here. It was something that already had purpose. So I think similar to Jackie Robinson, whether we knew it or not, his life bared a greater purpose. In addition to helping build this community garden, the Rays are also investing $100,000 to five local organizations all committed to ending systemic racism. And as Hannah mentioned, five groups will be receiving $20,000 each as part of the Rays investment. Yeah, those groups are the Skills Center, the Pace Center for Girls Hillsborough County, the Arts Conservatory for Teens, Brain Expansion Scholastic Training, and Gulf Coast Jewish Family and Community Services.